Tunneling Viewer supports the dynamic and cascading parameters of version XI and above, but beyond that, it also provides dynamic and cascading parameter functionality for any Crystal Reports version. And the way it implements it is by allowing you to use other reports as parameter dialogues. So I'm starting this report, and you can see that in here, in this, within this dialog, what gets rendered here is actually another Crystal Report that returns all the possible years, all the possible order years in our database. And I can click on that report to select a different value. If I click OK, I get here a listing of product types. And again, I can click to select values, or I can remove some of these values. And this is a cascade whereby this product type selection controls what products are shown. So competition and helmets are selected here. I click OK, and I can see only the products that belong to competition and helmets. And again, I can delete all of these selected values and select those that I want. As you can see, the parameter dialogues remember the values from the prior sessions. And if I click OK, I get the report. So now the question is, how do we actually implement this? So let me switch to Crystal and show you how that works. So here's the main report, and the key is that the parameters for this main report, one is the year choice and the other one is the product choice, are named as other Crystal reports. So the year prompt is really prompt order year version 11.rpt, which looks like this. Here's the report. And all it does, it, it groups by the uh, year of the order date. In fact, I can view it. And you can see that's what that parameter dialog showed us before. If I go back to the main report, let's look at the prompt products version 11.rpt. And that particular report has its own parameters. So that's how the cascade is uh, achieved. The report that is used as a parameter has its own parameter. And in this particular case, that parameter is also dynamic and shows a listing of product types. This is much more flexible than, than Crystal alone because any prompt or any parameter within that cascade can be of any type. In Crystal, a dynamic cascade of parameters has to all use dynamic parameters. While here, this particular parameter could be a static parameter, a type in parameter. So you can mix and match with more flexibility 